Citrus fruits are more than just a staple in our diets. They're a cornerstone of global agriculture and economies. The citrus industry not only supports jobs, but also drives economic growth in many countries, including the US, with California being the largest citrus producer within the US. However, this vital industry faces a grave threat. Climate change and devastating diseases are jeopardizing citrus production. This crisis threatens the livelihoods of farmers and the availability of these essential fruits. The future of citrus is at a critical point, making the need for innovation and adaptation more urgent than ever. But there's a significant challenge. Developing new citrus varieties is a slow process, especially for trees that take years to mature. This sluggish pace makes it difficult to quickly respond to threats like droughts, pests and diseases such as citrus greening, also known as HLB. To safeguard the future of citrus, a new approach is needed. So how can we accelerate the process? The answer lies in an innovative approach, using metabolic models as a cutting-edge tool. These models act like detailed maps of a plant's metabolism, charting all the chemical reactions happening inside a citrus plant. By understanding these intricate pathways, scientists can unlock the secrets of citrus growth. Metabolic models help identify genes and enzymes crucial for fruit quality, yield and resistance to diseases and drought. This knowledge is key to developing new and improved citrus varieties. Imagine being able to pinpoint the exact gene responsible for drought tolerance or identifying the enzyme that enhances vitamin C content in an orange. Metabolic models give scientists this power, allowing them to manipulate plant traits with precision. This targeted approach is faster and more efficient than traditional breeding methods. Building a metabolic model is a complex process. It starts with collecting data from the plant. Techniques like RNA sequencing and metabolomics are used. RNA sequencing shows which genes are active in a plant cell, revealing which proteins are produced. Metabolomics provides a snapshot of small molecules called metabolites, which are products of metabolism. Computational tools analyze this data, identifying patterns and interactions. This network of data forms the basis of the metabolic model. The construction of the first citrus metabolic model, which contains 10,000 493 chemical reactions was recently completed by scientists at the University of California, San Diego and Riverside. By analyzing these models, scientists can determine which nutrients and conditions will optimize growth. For example, they might discover that adjusting certain amino acids or sugars in the growth media can significantly speed up root and shoot development. The next step is to validate these findings in the lab. If the plants grow faster using the model's recommendations, it confirms the model's effectiveness. This means we can reduce the time it takes to develop new citrus varieties. Currently, scientists at the University of California, San Diego and Riverside are working to accelerate citrus growth during the engineering process. The project aims to use metabolic models to predict optimal media formulations to increase citrus growth rate during two critical steps in the plant engineering process, specifically those involving agrobacterium-based engineering and CRISPR-based gene editing. Focusing on Washington Naval and Carrizo citrus plants, the UC researchers aim to speed up the growth of citrus roots and shoots in these engineering processes. Term. One key feature of metabolic models lies in their ability to accelerate the development of new citrus varieties. Traditionally, breeding new citrus cultivars has been a long and arduous process, involving crossing different varieties and selecting offspring with desirable traits. This process can take years, even decades, to produce a commercially viable variety. Metabolic models provide a shortcut by identifying key genes and enzymes, allowing scientists to target specific traits for improvement. This approach significantly reduces the time it takes to develop new varieties. Instead of waiting years, researchers can screen for desired traits in the lab using the model as a guide. This accelerated pipeline means that new improved citrus varieties can reach farmers and consumers much faster. Faster development of new citrus varieties has far-reaching implications. Farmers can respond more quickly to emerging challenges. New varieties resistant to diseases like HLB can be developed rapidly, mitigating economic losses. Varieties that withstand drought or tolerate salinity help combat the effects of climate change. This rapid response ensures a stable and sustainable citrus industry. 
Metabolic models can help reduce reliance on pesticides and water. Disease-resistant varieties minimize chemical treatments, reducing environmental impact. Drought-tolerant varieties help conserve water. Metabolic models can help advance citrus farming. By addressing the slow pace of plant engineering, metabolic models pave the way for a future where citrus crops are more robust, sustainable and plentiful. This knowledge tackles critical challenges related to climate change, disease and food security, ensuring a bright future for citrus production.